Hi guys, I am doing a quick little video today because I got another Influencer Vox Box and it wasn't that long in between Vox Boxes this time. So this one is the L'Oreal Advanced Hair Care, I guess is the name of the box, is that what it is? Let me see. And I wanted to do this because I just washed my hair and used these three products so I wanted to do a first impressions. It's the Extraordinary Oil Shampoo System is the correct name for this, right? As you guys know, Influencer is a program that sends you this stuff to review for free in exchange for a review and posting on social media and everything, so let's just get that out of the way. I didn't buy this. Um, so you get the Extraordinary Oil Shampoo, or Nourishing Shampoo, the Extraordinary Oil Nourishing Conditioner, and the Extraordinary Oil Lustrous Oil Serum. That's what this one looks like. And that's a pretty good size for an oil serum type thing. It's 3.4 ounces. So I did just use all three of these. Now I was kind of weary because I just dyed my hair red and I am very particular about what I use for shampoo and conditioner and stuff when I have red hair because it fades so fast. I don't want to keep doing it. Blah, 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 blah. I used the the L'Oreal high, what is it called? High Color Highlights uh, in magenta. That is the color that's in my hair. Um, I love that stuff when that's usually the only red I will use when I do red hair. But um, I wanted to try this because I wanted to do my little first impressions video on it. So when I rinsed it out, I did notice red coming out, obviously, but that pretty much happens when you have red hair. You can't really help it when you're washing it. I believe that these are sulfate free because I'm not seeing I don't see it in the ingredients usually it'll say sulfate free on it but these don't but anyways you don't want to use shampoos and conditioners with sulfates when you have funky colored dye in your hair because it's just gonna make it uh, fade faster but anyway um, I don't notice a fade in my hair from before I washed it, which this is my first time washing it since I dyed it, um, so I don't notice a color fade, so that's good. That's the first thing. Second thing is these smell really good. They smell like, um, if you've ever smelled the Shea Cashmere scent from Bath & Body Works, that's like one of my favorite scents and I don't think they even make it anymore. Scent is always a big thing for me in hair products. I know it shouldn't matter that much, but like I don't really like coconut scents and um, so I like the smell. My hair smells nice now. So I used the shampoo, I used the conditioner like I normally do, and then once I dried my hair, no, before I dried my hair, I used some of the oil and just put it like from here down, concentrating most of it on the ends because my ends are clearly damaged. I haven't had a haircut in a really long time. but. My hair is super soft now and it's shiny. Hopefully you can tell that it's shiny. Um, I usually don't have too much problems with dry hair, luckily. Like, fingers crossed that never happens, but I have a ver very oily scalp and my hair tends to get greasy fast, so even though I try not to wash it a bunch of times because the more you wash it, the more oil your hair is naturally going to produce, I tend to feel gross if I have oily hair and I just end up washing it anyway, so that's besides the point. Um, I really like the oil stuff, and also I should mention, if you've been following me for a while, you know my hair is not naturally straight, it's naturally very curly and coarse and wavy and thick and I hate it, so I did have to straighten my hair and I only used these three products, like maybe that was a bad idea, maybe I should have used my heat protectant, but I wanted to like fully test these and see how my hair would look just using these three things and it looks like it usually looks when I straighten my hair, so that's a good thing as well. Um, it's really long now, like it grows really fast and I haven't had it cut in a long time so that is just my quick little review here I like these so far these are both 12.6 ounce bottles and then like I said 3.4 ounce of this so they're both gonna last a while I do have a lot of hair so shampoo and conditioner don't really last me as long as the average person but it doesn't have a price on here they did send me a two dollar coupon um, oh there's a 
transforming oil in cream oil complex as well. Um, it just looks like that. It does say eliminates dryness in just one wash. Um, but yeah, hopefully my hair doesn't get greasy in like a day with this. It does say... He's being so loud today. It does say um, lightweight, non-greasy for dry, lifeless hair. Um, I really like it so far though. And like I said, it doesn't have a price, but I used to work at Rite Aid, so I'm guessing they're around like $7 a bottle probably, because the L'Oreal stuff was always like $6.99. Um, I don't know, I'll have to look it up. But that was my quick little video. I hope you guys enjoyed. All my social media links will be below. Please subscribe to me if you aren't already, and I will talk to you in my next video.